move to get Cameron out. Lawrence should have been the one going. Cameron floated. But Lawrence, he played a good game, and he's going to obviously beat us if he makes it any farther. Hey, Daniel, don't be mad with Polly's decision. She did a good job. Thanks, Eric. I really appreciate it. I'm a cold. <coughs> I just want to go lie in bed. All right, Polly, go get some sleep. We don't want you to be sick in the big brother house. Thanks, guys. I really don't like Polly's decision. Cameron should have been in still, and Laura should have left. Even though Cameron didn't know my secret, and I needed him out. Lawrence is too strong. They will never know my secret. I'm playing them all. I'm not really nice. I'm evil. I've been to prison twice already. <laughs> I broke out both times. Yeah. Ah, yes. They will never find out that I would get them out one by one by one. I might tell them that I'm evil at the end after I win the money. But yeah, I'm winning this. Oh my gosh, I just heard Eric talking about his secret. So that's what Henry was talking about. And that's what um, 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 Cameron was talking about. Oh my gosh, I gotta tell Wayne and um, Lawrence. They're my only allies left in the game. Cookie, Tim, they're all gone. Same with Cameron. But I gotta go get Eric out as soon as possible. Hey, honey, buddy. Hey, honey. So, I, you know, remember when Henry was talking about celebrity snakes, but we got him out because he was th saying it was Eric, but Eric's too nice, right? It couldn't be Eric. Trust me, honey. It is Eric. I heard him while he was in the confession room. For reals, girl? For reals. Oh, my gosh. We gotta go get Wayne. Yeah, my little man. He's my buddy. Where is he? Hey. Were you stalking me or something? Yes, I was. Sorry. Hey, dude. So, we're thinking about getting out Eric next. Is that alright? Sure thing. Nah, I, was, I would prefer getting out Lawrence. It is now time for the... Ace to ace, but I'm going to do it different. I'm here with my friend LJ and his cousin Chase. Hi. So, there's gonna be, they're going to be going in a competition. The winner is safe, but those two get to pick who they want out of the ace to ace comp that they want not to win, um, win the ace to ace, but it can't be the one that wins the competition. The first one is who goes to Fargus. Wayne, you can't pick Wayne to get out. So, that means, first I'm going to ask LJ. LJ, who do you want out, out of Daniel, Eric, um, uh, Wilma, or Lawrence? Eric. Okay, Eric is out this ace or ace comp. Now, Chase, who do you want out this ace or ace comp? Daniel, Wilma, or Lawrence? Right. Daniel is out. So that leaves these three. So now they can't pick who they want out. Now it's going to go into full competition. Let's get ready for this. This first part is going to be tap tap, as I call it. So the last one gets to pick who they want, will not want out. Ooh, they both fell. But I got to tap Lawrence one more time. Lawrence. He will probably want out Wayne. So that means Wilma or Lawrence will be the next Ace of Eights. The one that goes the farthest is the next Ace of Eights. The next Ace of Eights is... Ooh, that was close. Gonna have to retry that. I bet Lawrence is pumped up for this because his name is Lawrence. My nickname is LJ. Yes. Okay. Wilma is the new head of household. Yay! Good job, Wilma! I was rather about being my girlfriend or me. Mm-hmm. Okay, I wonder who will be a victim. Yep, time to get into the nominations. 
after the talking and stuff. Thanks to it, Chase and Elsa for helping, and yeah. Yes, it feels so good to become the HOAs. I can't wait to get Eric out. I'm a goner. Yikes. Evo always says, Evil! Villa, please don't nominate me. I'm the cutest one here. I'm Daniel. I'm fabulous. All right, I won't nominate you, but I already decided on my nominees. This is the nomination ceremony. If I call your name, you're safe. Wayne, Lawrence, and Polly. I nominate you, Eric, and you, Daniel. Good luck. But this time it's different. You're nominating three nominees. So nominate one more. Obviously, Polly. Okay, so your final nominees is Eric, Daniel, and Polly. So time to get into the veto. If the veto is used, one of these two will have to be on the nomination block. Good luck. Um, I'm so confused. Why am I on the nomination block? I'm so cute. I deserve to be not on the nomination block. Even Wilma told me she wouldn't nominate me. This game is rigged. It is time for the power of veto. This power of veto is tap tap. Ooh, we got two that fell in the first round. Now we're going to do a different comp each round. Okay. So, the one that comes in last is out. Lawrence is out this power of veto. Alrighty. So, now it's time to do, um, with my hands like I showed you before. Go back and forth. You'll see them fall. So, Okay, so, I got it, and Polly wins the veto. Yay! Polly saved herself, so that means Daniel and Eric are the final nominees. But, this time it's different. Like I said, well, it's still different. So, first part, third no three nominees. Second part, Polly is the pick who goes home between Eric and Daniel. Polly, go to diary room. Diary room and cast your soul vote to evict. I sadly vote to evict Daniel. The votes are in, and the one eliminated from this game is Daniel. What? How did I get eliminated? I'm so fabulous. No, you aren't. Sorry, Daniel. That's what happens when you um um decide. Say that my decisions are bad. Eric was giving me a compliment. But no, nah, sorry, dude. You're out. Hi, I miss you. Well, bye, guys. It's been fun. All right, final five.